National studies have found that minority students are not receiving the same quality of education as their non-minority counterparts. Who can parents hold responsible for failing to provide an equal education to all students, regardless of color? And where does the buck stop? Who wants to go first? I guess I've been pushed out. <laughs> Um, I guess it dovetails with what I just said. We should hold ourselves responsible for that. Um, uh, I have two young, uh, young men who graduated from MPS, and I didn't take the perspective of it was somebody else's responsibility to make sure that they got a quality education. I held myself, my wife and I, accountable for that. Now, the mayor spoke to the issue of parents being able to navigate systems, and it's an excellent point. Um, for one reason or another, our parents, some of our parents may not know how to navigate systems. It's our responsibility then to make sure they know how and that the systems are navigable. The other thing that parents have to do is be able to advocate in a way that gets those necessary resources for their young people. We can teach parents how to advocate properly and navigate systems. Then we take excuses away for folks not doing what they need to do, which is take ownership of their child's education. That child and that parent need to take ownership of it and then work those systems to get what they need. If we can create systems to do that and they keep pushing us, everybody will get what they need. Could I just add that I 